Listen, I've already talked about this when this, this story first broke last year. Amy Geiger should be arrested based on pure stupidity. Like, how do you enter an apartment that isn't yours, that clearly isn't yours, and then you murder the person that's in that apartment, their own apartment, and claim you were in quote unquote fear of your life. You see, that tactic, fear of your fear of your life by these white supremacists and even suspected white supremacists, all that is is a defense mechanism to say, I don't like black people. That's it. That's all it is. I mean, and this is the system of racism, white supremacy. This is what we live in. Um, you have to understand the cold system concept of it. And when they say, I was in fear of my life, therefore I had to shoot. That is cold for I don't like black people around me. I don't like black niggers around me. That's what it is. You know what I'm saying? So, um, Amy Geiger is, she deserves everything coming for her. The white sympathy tears will not save you. I don't even understand why the jury had to do a deliberation of six hours. This was clear and dry, clear cut and dry. Like there should have been a decision to make sure this woman faces the full extent of the law, you know, in prison, never gets out. Um, she's 31 years old. She looks like she's 41, to be honest. She looks really old for her age. Um, and, you know, she, she deserves everything that's coming to her because she cut the life short of both them Jean, 26-year-old black man who had his own apartment, minding his own business, cut his life short, made and changed the life of his family forever. Right? Um, so yeah, that's, that, that's what it is, man. You know, that's what it is. Uh, you know, th there's really no excuse at all. You can say you worked a 72 hour shift and you were just tired. doesn't matter. You enter the wrong apartment. It's common sense. You enter the wrong apartment. You murder a person who lives in his own apartment because you claim you were in fear of your life again. That is code for saying, I don't like black people around me, period. So, you know, she deserves everything coming towards her. Um, and again, those white sympathy tears did not save her. Um, you know, last thing I want to say this, you know, we, we have instances, I mean, black society will have, we always have instances of a singularity form of justice, meaning that this case and um, both him, Gene, and the family of both him, Gene, you know, he'll never come back. He's rest in peace to him, but both of them will never come back from this. So the only form of justice they can get is making sure Amy Amber Geiger. Amy, Amber, whatever, could care less, receives the fullest extent of the law being charged with murder, first degree murder, hopefully it is what she's charged with. That's the only amount of so-called justice they can get. And that's what they give us, trinkets. That's what the system of racism, white supremacy gives us, trinkets. They give us those kind of symbolic victories because that's all we're good for. Until we get something to replace this system of injustice with the system of justice where we black society is rewarded with what we deserve in the first place and that's reparations we're always going to get these side deals these singularity symbolic victories of justice that affects only a few people in black society not us as a whole collectively as a group right so that's what I mean by that so just wanted, to let, uh, just wanted to give you guys my thoughts about this Amy Geiger verdict, Amber Geiger verdict. Um, I'm glad she's found guilty. Hopefully, you know, she hopefully uh, she 
serves the full extent of the law for a sentencing and she's charged with the highest degree of murder which is first degree murder for this um and that's all there is to it i would never feel sorry for white society at all period <laughs> point blank and simple at all especially with cases like this you know so those are my quick thoughts about that family leave your comments down below let me know what you guys think about this uh amber geiger case she's found guilty all right family Make sure you follow me on social media at GMOG Media TV. Sorry for the long hiatus of videos, but I'm going to try to get back in the swing of things and put more content out on my channel, GMOG Media TV family. Till next time, make sure you follow me on Instagram at GMOG Media TV. Chauncey signing out. Peace.